How's it going YouTube? It's me again with another review and this is a Chewy Windows tablet that is imported so you get to see me open this. So here we have it. It is a 7 inch tablet which I am a fan of or this might be the 8, this is the 8 inch sorry. As we put this to the side for a little bit, we'll see what else is under here. We have the manual most likely, yep, telling you how and what is in the tablet. And then the last box here, we have the charger, Americanized finally, and the micro USB, micro USB type C. So if you've been looking to get into USB type C, this will also charge my Nexus 6P as well. Just to show you, right into my Nexus 6P. So this tablet is future-proof already. And I happen to like this still standard USB plug-in for computers or other wall chargers because my Nexus 6P charger comes double-ended USB Type-C. I'm making a big deal about this cord because it is a big deal. All right, now holding this guy right here, right away in the back, plastic, but it actually feels less hollow inside. This is the HI8 Chewy tablet, and this is the VI8. Chewy tablet. White Chewy does dual boot of Android 4.4 and Windows 8. This Chewy is only Windows, Windows 10. 64 bit, 800p by 1280. So let's take this off. Now, the first thing I'm going to check is if it's glass. It is plastic. My experience with plastic front panels. It scratches very easy. Before powered on, I want to take a look at the outside to see if there's any differences between the last Chewy. Both are 64-bit Intel chips. They're running the same input voltage and amps. Speakers in the back, 5 megapixels in the back, which I never use on a tablet. Micro SD expansions, so you're not stuck with 16 or 32 gigabytes that they come with. It has aluminum metal trims around the sides. Headphone jack, micro HDMI, and the USB Type-C charging. Now I want to turn this one on. So hitting the power, see if it has it. There we go, Chewy. It's already booted, ready for me to press stuff. You see everything's gonna be working, looks good. I really like these small tablets that are really cheap. These are under $100 for these tablets. This is the 800 resolution. The Chewy Hi8 is actually a higher resolution tablet. But you can see the battery. What's opening up in here? Let's go into my photos to see what's in there. It's very, you know, responsive. Everything I touch seems to be accurately hitting. Touching that, we see there's a desktop and desktop there, control panel, there's a store. This is running on Windows 10. It's authentic, so you don't have to worry about it not being it. Um, I don't know how much more you guys want me to get into this because, you know, it's supposed to be a cheap Windows 10 tablet, which by my experience, judging by the Chewy Hi8, it's performed very good. I've watched lots of Netflix movies. I didn't like 4.4 on a tablet, so I only need the Windows. If you just want Windows, which is preferably for my case, this one right here, the VI8, would be the best choice for right now. Unless, of course, you want the dual booting thing. This also has a screen protector on it, but underneath is also plastic. It's not glass, so I'll just leave the screen protectors on. As you can tell now, I got all the bubbles in there. So there you guys have it. This is the VI8 Chewy tablet. If you don't know how to use Windows PC, uh, <laughs> I don't know what else to say. This is supposed to do all that. It's in a small form factor, of course. Lightweight, don't expect to do heavy editing on this. It's just supposed to be a cheaper version of not having to get an Android tablet because it doesn't do everything Windows tablets can do. So in this case, you get the price of a nice Android tablet and you get to experience and stay with Windows 10. Thank you for joining and that's it for me and as always I will see you guys next time. Later.